Mac Corporation. One of the test items in cable harness testing is dielectric withstand testing. High voltage is applied to the tested target to verify that there is no discharge phenomenon between different conductors. Multiple factors and application patterns must be properly set. In addition to wiring testing, dielectric withstand testing can be conducted for high quality harness testing. Dielectric withstand testing is aimed at detecting processing errors. IDC cable is manufactured by press fitting wires into the terminals of the connector. If the wire is misaligned and pressure welded, it will be close to the next terminal. This will result in discharge and withstand voltage failure. When terminals are crimped, wires may come out of the connector terminals or the terminal shape may be abnormal. In this case, conductors approach adjacent terminals and discharge. Failure of the withstand voltage testing can be caused by soldering errors. Excessive solder or bridging may cause discharge near the terminals. Discharge may also occur through solder dust. Electric discharge may occur when wire chips are mixed into the connector. Tests can be conducted in accordance with the test method for connectors of electronic equipment. As the test voltage increases, the test becomes more severe, as insulation breakdown is more likely to occur. Excessive testing voltages increase the cost of installation and may damage the test target. It is necessary to select testers and voltage settings that meet specifications. During high voltage to the high side, the leakage current value is monitored on the low side. When the set value is exceeded, the test is judged as failed. A smaller set value makes the test more severe, while a larger value makes the test easier. It is the time per application. The longer the time, the more electrical load is applied to the test target. The application time is specified in the Japanese industrial standards. There are cases in which the test is completed in a shorter time by increasing the test voltage, depending on discussions with the customer. There are several application methods. With scan, voltage is applied to one pin at a time, while all other pins are monitored. Apply high voltage to all pins in sequence. This method is equivalent to testing by a withstand voltage tester. Flat is for testing ribbon cables. It is intended for testing adjacent pins and is completed in two applications. In the matrix, the circuits are automatically divided into groups and then applied. After that, the circuits in the group are tested by the scan method. Log2 is a unique application method of NAT Corporation. Circuits are divided into two groups and applied. After that, the group is further divided into two groups, and the voltage is applied to achieve withstand voltage testing of all circuits. This method requires the least number of applications. It is best for normal harness testing. The application table for each method can be downloaded from our website. Group application, such as Log2, completes the test in a short time. However, the leakage current value increases, making the test severe. Then auto transition mode is helpful. If the leakage current value exceeds the set value, the application method is automatically switched and the test continues. When adjacent circuits are fixed, such as connectors and boards, the test can be conducted by the requested application. In testing long multi-core cables, AC voltage cannot detect the defects correctly. This is because the capacitance between the different conductors becomes large. 
As a result, the capacitive reactance becomes small, and current leaks between the different conductors regardless of the withstand voltage failure. With DC voltage, the withstand voltage test of long multicore cables can be conducted without the influence of capacitive reactance. The RMS value of DC differs from that of AC. DC multiplied by square root 2 is equivalent to AC. Jigs for high voltage testing must be able to withstand the test voltage. Otherwise, if a defect is detected, the cause cannot be identified. For dielectric withstand testing, Nachman series is the best choice. We have experience in various specifications and operations with customization. NAC Corporation